there are a couple of incidences where I felt very strong nudges from God to give. One, I was in a taxi and uh, the, the woman was driving and I asked her how her day was going and she says, oh, I'm just the devil's target. <laughs> I said, the devil's target? What do you mean? And she was telling me about the situation she was in. And uh, I just felt God saying to me, you could help her, Debbie. You could help her. So I found a lawyer for her. And uh, she said to me, did God send me an angel? <laughs> I said, I think he must have. <laughs> I was in a grocery store. It was our first time back in Florida after being away many months. So I had a full cart of groceries. And I was busy just putting everything up on the... The, what do they call that, a counter? And uh, the lady in front of me was talking to the clerk and then all of a sudden she just left and her groceries were there. So I asked the clerk, well, what happened? And she said, well, she didn't have enough money with her. She went to get more money. And uh, so I was thinking, and I just felt the strongest urge to pay for her groceries. And so I told the clerk, I, I'll, I'll, I would like to pay for those groceries. And the clerk said, no, no, you, you really can't do that because we don't even know if she's going to come back. You don't have to do that. I said, no, I know I don't have to do that. I want to do that. And she said, we don't even know if she's going to come back. And I said, well, if she doesn't, you can give the food to someone who needs it or to a food bank. And she says, why are you doing this? And, and she was not pleasant about it. She was just very almost angry. And I said, you know, I really felt God asking me to do that. And as she started scanning my groceries, she didn't say anything. And then finally she looked up and she said, I think I'd like to know more about this God of yours. So it was definitely, I felt a nudge from God. And I also realized that it wasn't for the lady with the groceries. It was for that clerk.